Hello and welcome to Diary of My Frugal Life. Today is Saturday, the 10th of June, um, and I want to uh, do the check-in for week one and stuff uh, week two. So it was a busy week with lots of things. Um, I finally um, had the courage to start buying things for my garden, as you may have seen uh, on my Instagram. Um, so yes, uh, let's see how much did I spend. So on Sunday, I had to fill my car with petrol and it was 39 uh, 32 pence. And then on Monday, uh, me and my son decided to uh, buy um, the table set with the parasol for our garden. Um, we also assembled uh, our um, swimming pool that we have. We bought it two years ago, so we didn't spend money on that. It was already paid. Uh, but I had um, an old sofa in the middle of the garden, so I had to pay for the council to come and collect it. Um, and also we bought a small barbecue so we can, uh, you know, have some barbecue. Uh, in the garden. Um, we didn't buy a parasol base yet because I saw one on Tesco for £10 that you fill with water and for us it's more than okay, we don't need to buy something else but when we went to buy it, because we didn't buy it when we saw it, there wasn't any anymore so I'm waiting to see if it's back in stock soon. Otherwise I will have to go to B&Q and buy a more expensive one. I also had to buy uh, a kit to change my tap outside. Um, it kind of, there was a bit of broken and we need to uh, take care of that. Um, so yes, I was back on work, uh, to work um, on Monday as well, after a week off. I had a non spend day on what, Tuesday and Wednesday. And then on Thursday, uh, my son uh, has been uh, quite unwell actually. And he spent the day at home on Thursday and he couldn't eat anything. So I didn't have nothing to, you know, prepare a soup or anything. So I went to Tesco and I bought a tin of tomato soup um, for £1.90 um, so he could eat. And then I had to add £15 on petrol as well. And no spend day on Friday. Um, and today I paid £6.35 for my work expenses and £23.65 on my groceries. So now it's time to do, oh, to look at my purse and do some cash stuffing. So if I look at my purse first, oh, this is the right way. So let's see what's left. So I've got some change in groceries. Some change in petrol. Now, last week, if you remember, I only added 50 pounds for petrol. Then I put almost 40 pounds on Sunday and I had to uh, top up. Uh, on Thursday, so I was a bit worried that £10 wouldn't be enough. That was what I had left uh, on my petrol uh, budget. So I took £5 from work expenses because I knew I wouldn't need £15 this week. So from the £10 I had left, I still have change. That was nice. I didn't spend anything on my just-in-case envelope and the eating out we didn't spend we still rolls so let's see how much is left no notes but lots of coins one two three four five six seven Eight, fifty, and lots of change. So the first thing I'm going to do with this money, I'm going to get my health challenge. Gonna get my dice. 
Now 850. I'm not sure if I can. Uh, well, I'm going to try to roll the two dice, but if it's bigger than an eight, I can't put more than eight, basically. So if it's nine on above, I will just put eight pounds. Oh, can you see this? It was a six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Lovely. I was able to do it. Lovely. Now, um, what I'm going to do with these, I am going to put the 50p on my giving envelope. That's where my 50p is going. Oh, I should do six on here. Almost done, but I'm still looking to add some more. So 50 pounds for giving. So now on giving, I will have so one, two, three pounds in giving because I used some. Uh, and should I add this for coffee? Let me add these two pounds in coffee because I want to do every two pounds. So that's what I'm going to do. So now I have six pounds for coffee. Lovely. Oh, and I'm going to do the change as well. So let me get my penny changing count how much is here put this away so 20 40 60 80 90 1 pound 5 10 15 20 25 27 28 so I've got 1 pound 28 that's more than I expected, actually. So, let me see what I'm going to do. So, if I take the 55. And can I take the 54? Yes. So, I can take 54. And I can also take 19. So this is just a quicker way of saving some pennies. And let me get my tin. It's getting heavy, you know. I know I'm not going to save loads in this tin because my penny saving challenge, I think, equals to around 15 pounds or something like that. Um... But, you know, it's still good. And what I'm going to do is I've got uh, um, an account in Metro where I can just go and put them, the coins in the coin machine. So that way I don't need to bag them and it's going to be very easy to do it. So when I finish this penny challenge, I will uh, put the money there and then stuff it somewhere and then start again the penny challenge, if that makes sense. Okay, so let's see the money for this week. Oh, did I left one pound here. Yes, I did. Oh, didn't take all the money from my weekly envelope. So I should have one. 165 pounds 20 40 60 80 100 20 10 30 oh, 10 20 oh my goodness yeah 110 20 25 30 35 40 45 no it makes no sense 20 40 
60, 80, 100, 120, 140, 140, 150, 160, 165. I don't know how to count. Gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm sure you don't like to um, watch me waffling while I, while I am counting cash. But I am so sorry. I'm terrible. So I need to get my budget planner. You don't need to look at these, but I need to see when I'm going to put my money. So. The first I'm going to do. I am going to put £25 on my emergency fund. Now, my emergency fund is quite low at the moment. Even in the bank, it's very low. I've got £24.50 here. And I don't have much in the bank as well because I kind of spent it. So now I've got a bit more. So I just need a pen to mark off for my planner that I actually stuff this envelope. But otherwise I get confused. I'm so sorry. So the next one, I need £10 for my car insurance. So that's my next stuffing. I definitely want to have enough money to... Um, pay my insurance in November in full. So I know I have £110 in the bank. 10, 20, 25, 30. I've got £33 and I'm adding... I already added, didn't I? Yes, I did. I'm very confused. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to swap these for the 20. Because I'm always like... And these week I didn't go to the bank because my son's been really poorly so he had to go to the doctors yesterday um, referred by the 111 uh, and the doctor said if it's not better in 24 hours he needs to go to the hospital so I've been at home monitoring him to make sure he's alright and he's not getting worse so that's what I've been doing um, so no time to go to the bank and of course I'm not sleeping um, so yeah so, insurance is done, and now I need £5 for my car payment. Another envelope that I definitely want to start stuffing, even if it's just fiver every month. So, at the moment, I've got 25 so 30 and now I don't need to change this. I won't need it at the moment. So, the next envelope, oh, there's no more this week. Now it's just my purse, so... Now I just need to stuff my purse. So, groceries, I will have 30 pounds for groceries. So 20, I'm going to 25, 30. And I am going to roll the dice. I just need one dice. And it's six, again a six. And this money will go towards debt. Yes, I've got £24. That's correct. I'm confused. I'm so sorry. I'm a bit confused. Okay. So, Petro will have 50. So, 20, 40, 50. Hopefully, this week is enough to have 50 pounds, so I don't need to go and get anything from anywhere. Now, I need to put 20 in Orkis expenses. I'm going to put a, a full one. I need to put 20, because uh, I need to buy more things this week, so that's why. Uh, now I've got £10 for just in case and £5 for eating out. But now, just in case, 
I need to roll the dice as well. So, oh, it's a one. So, I need to get my tin. Where is my big tin? I need some change. I got five. No, I can't have. Oh, yes, I can have these and then I have my ten. So that's fine. So one pound towards that. And I have nine pounds just in case. So this is it for anything I want to buy for myself. I just call it just in case because it's just in case I want to buy something. Because if I call it spending, I might just feel like I really have to spend it. But no, it's just in case I want something. So yes, now I have 10 pounds left. So let's play with these 10 pounds. But to play with these 10 pounds, I need to change it for two fives. And what I'm gonna do, Oh, first, let me put these towards that. Otherwise, I will mix the money and that's a big no. Now, what I'm going to do with this money is, at the end of the month, I'm going to make sure that it goes to the bank and I'm going to pay my credit card. Now, I'm going to roll to save twice, five pounds to two different categories, depending on the dice. One, oh, for cats. So this is for cats Christmas. So as you know, I started this challenge last week. So another fiver. They've been very lucky getting lots of fivers. And the last five I will go to car payment. So I'm always going to start my new challenges uh, when I'm in a better position, if that makes sense. So, yeah. So, another five. 20.35. Makes me very happy that this is building up. Of course, I need £3,000 in March 25 I still have a long way to go but you know everything helps uh, I hope you enjoyed my video um, I wish you all a good week uh, lots of savings lots of challenges on your way and if you like my video please hit the button and you know if you would like subscribe to my channel thank you so much for your support and for watching my videos bye